South Florida's Cuban community already showing its support for Cubans planning to protest. Hundreds took mark in a caravan and more rallies are expected to take place today across South Florida. CBS 4's Deborah Souverain has more. Deborah, good morning. Good morning, Maribel. Demonstrators say Cubans on the island have been suffering for far too long, and they'd like to bring greater attention to what's happening there. And that is why rallies are being held today throughout South Florida. There will be one later this morning behind, at, excuse me, here behind us at Freedom Tower. Organizers say this is all about freedom. The love for my country and the injustice that has been committed for 62 years. An emotional Barbara Diaz said she had to join this demonstration where hundreds waved Cuban flags and gathered at Tamiami Park. I love the USA and this is my second home, but for me, Cuba is my first place. And she's been thinking about that ever since historic protests this past summer in Cuba, in which many took to the streets for better living conditions. People that live there, they deserve better, they deserve freedom, justice, freedom of expression. It's a lot of pain, I still have family there, and they hardly have anything to eat, no medicine, not even aspirins. Diaz and her husband joined this caravan down Southwest 8th Street with hundreds of vehicles. We saw it from the air and from the ground. We're here to support the folks that are fighting very hard in Cuba, our, our brothers and sisters who are spilling blood in order to get that freedom back. The Assembly of the Cuban Resistance organized this protest, said organizer Orlando Gutierrez. All eyes on Cuba. Uh, the entire world must be looking at that regime. Uh, we're trying to, to prevent a bloodbath in Cuba. Uh, our arrests have already begun. There, we want to send a very clear message to those thugs in power in Havana that the world is watching what they do and that there will be consequences for their violations of human rights. Now, coming up in our next half hour, we'll have more on the demonstrations that occurred over the weekend, as well as what's planned for later this morning. We're live in downtown Miami. I'm Deborah Souverain, CBS 4, this morning.